Hello Aries, I'm Susie from the Gifts of O'Toole and I'm here to read your cards for the week of the 14th of September. So angels, spirit guides, universe, what would you like? I've seen the reversal, hold on. What would you like Aries to know about the week of the 14th of September please? The 14th of September, the 14th of September, I can't find it. It was the page of pentacles, 14th of September, angels. For Aries, please. Aries, Aries, for the week of the 14th of September, please. For Aries, what would you like Aries to know about this week of the 14th of September? What would you like Aries to know? There he is, look. It's obviously meant to be reversed. We'll leave him reversed. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Aries to know about the week of the 14th of September, please? For Aries, what are the images for Aries for this September the 14th? For the week of the 14th of September, for Aries, Aries. Aries, Aries, Aries. Week of the 14th of September for Aries, please, angels. Okay, so there's a few cards here. One, two. Which one's Aries to know? What's going on with Aries? Blimey, Aries. Okay, on the bottom of the deck, we have the Wheel of Fortune. Oh, thank God. <laughs> this is fate. Um, the time has come for these witches that may have been pushing this wheel backwards. It's time now. There's a, there's an element of fate in this. Whatever's happening now, it's uh, karmic. It's in your favour. It's lucky, okay? So the time is now. Um, we've got the Three of Cups with the world as your first two cards. So... There may have been a, maybe a celebration or some kind of party, a date, something like that, a group of women. It can mean third party situation. Um, but it seems like there's a, there's a completion here where you feel like they'll, you'll come to an end of something. It could be you don't want to party anymore or you just don't want to be part of anything that's like a marriage or a third party situation. You feel like you've got all the knowledge at your disposal now. You feel you've been through enough to know that um, you can give birth to something new. But you're going to look back and say, look at how I did that. I've actually come a long way. I've come a long way. Um, you may feel that you might have problems with a child, uh, that something's not, uh, didn't go right, that there's something that didn't bear fruit and that there wasn't an expression of love um, coming forward. This uh, It's a difficult read because if there's something ended. It could be to do with a marriage. There's a completion to something. It's taking, it's a graduation, right? And you feel like this hermaphrodite having a little dance. It's time to have a little dance, have a break, Aries. Maybe you do need to go to a party. Maybe there's a birthday coming up this week. Um, but I feel that's the past. It's like you've you've completed something of, of a party lifestyle. So this, this earth sign here could be a child um, or something is not bearing fruit for the future. It's like this your crops didn't and you didn't have a good crop this year do you know what I mean and this pet king of cups is upside down he's 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 not emotional to towards things there's not love coming from from this um for some reason this could be a cancer scorpio pisces but he's just not feeling it he's just not he's misrepresenting if he was upright it'd be a counselor really kind um expressing love playing an instrument being kind to people upside down he's not it's not really trustworthy could be drinking um so this book makes for some reason you sovereign which is i love the nine of pentacles because it's a published book it's like i've made it i've mastered my craft it's like amongst whatever's going on here maybe someone's married they've got kids they're not representing they're drinking but amongst it you're sovereign you're becoming master and completing something like graduating um, and you're ready to go off into the unknown and um start something it's like, well, you get this message 
of a ring, a gift. Someone's coming in to start something brand new with you. They've got an uprush of feeling all of a sudden, and it's love. And they want to offer you a commitment. Okay? So, one minute, it's like, I'm done. <laughs> because there's problems here that aren't bearing fruit. Someone's not talking to me. They're not expressing enough love to me. I'll just be sovereign. I'm just going to do what I do. Um, it's all, I'm here and I'm too old in the tooth. Do you know what I mean? Um, and I'm just going to go anywhere. But here, I've got, I'm antsy. I want to do something, another quest. You're offered this new beginning of this solid surprise. Could be a ring, could be something that's a, a seed for the future. That's a new beginning. There's two aces together. It's like, it's like security and love together. With the Hierophant is a commitment. Okay, someone's offering you a commitment. This enables you to get out of this third party or this emotional head every and have this sort of air travel or communication or um, it's a swift creative time. It's really... Um, It's travel, but, now there's a big but here. You've got the death and the tower together, all right? Next to this travel. All right, so there could be something where someone can't get to you. There could be something out of the blue that ends, but it's because it's making way for a twin flame. It's like there's a twin flame here coming in. It's, it's shocking. It's that something ends suddenly and it allows this, this eye to eye meeting. I don't know what happens as a cancellation of a, a travel or you're getting out of a trap. You're committed to this spiritual path. Someone's offering you something. It could be a new home, keys to a home. There's two new beginnings here, new love, new commitment. Um, it enables you to get out of this mind overwhelm that, that's keeping you trapped. You're walking out of it. You're traveling, but there's there's an ending. It's new. It's a shocking ending it's with tears. So be careful traveling, Aries. At the end of this week, um, there is an eye to eye meeting. There's a soulmate union here. Um, it's gonna really. It's it it has secrets around it. It's it's sort of. It's going to confuse you for a month at least, but someone is coming towards you with information about a secret um i need to sort of get the um, the the love cards here because that seems to be a big situation do you know what i mean so you've got these you could be where are we so we're trying we're on the 14th 15th what day 14th wednesday 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Next Wednesday, next Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. There's something of, could be. You meet your twin flame in an, well, there's. This person could come towards you to talk to you and you're getting out of this overwhelm. It's like, or you could be offered air travel. With the death in the tower there, I would say possibly don't go in. There could be a cancellation. Um, but which are that amongst it, amongst this shock and this ending, there is this union, there's this soulmate. And it's going to really confuse you. It could be dealing with a, a, a water sign or a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But there's someone here that's coming in to tell you something, maybe to get you out of this confusion. We did have the Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck. There is, oh, and now I've just pulled the cards up and on the bottom there's the Nine of Cups. There's an ending and a secret's exposed. Someone's coming in, they've got your back. Whatever it is, they've got your back. They want to talk. Something needs to be shaken up. Something needs to be exposed. Something needs to be together. It is. It's. 
Well, it's, it's someone's offering marriage, someone's offering commitment, they're offering, but it's new, it's new things, it's kind of like the start of, and the start of a new business, the start of a new lo a love feeling, the commitment to something, but you need to untrap yourself from something else, or someone does, maybe someone's untrapping themselves from a marriage, and they're coming towards you, um, because something's, they've lost their home or something, so, or someone, there could be like something, be careful with travel with the moon there uh in the night or someone could come to your house in the night and it's sort of out of the blue but this person's coming in to tell you something to to fight your corner it could disrupt a situation but it's to fight your corner and it's this is going to go on for a month whatever it is let's ask the romance angel cards what this is angel spirit guys for aries please aries what would you like aries it's very rare that you get a combination of cards like that and you've got like one two in that stretch up there that three major arcanas someone's rushing in they've got your back to tell you about a secret to do with the twin flame because someone's something's cancelled something's ended as this communication could be an end to a marriage an end to a, but it's the start of a new love affair angel spirit guides universe what would you like aries to know about the week of the 14th of september give us some clarification of what's happening here angels spirit guides what's happening here with aries for this week there's a lot here soulmate yes this is your soulmate that's a double card that's got in here from the other deck soulmate look both together yes this is your soulmate double clarity Calling in your soulmate. <laughs> this is strange. Your prayers, affirmations and visualisations help bring you together. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Engagement. Your love life is ascending to a high level of commitment and reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. This is going to be... This is going to be like mad. Someone's rushing in to tell you something that was going to be, it's going to be confusing. After an ending, there's so much communication going on. You're untrapping, you're, you're not overwhelmed anymore. You've got that double eight, you've got the double one. Um... <sighs> You're about to go around and do something again. But this time you've got the t-shirt. It doesn't feel like... It feels like there's a, an upset with a child. Or that someone's not bearing fruit. There's an upset with a, a water sign. They're, they've got, like... Maybe they're a drinker. So you just try and be sovereign. Do your thing. Master yourself. Be outside. You're speaking to animals, the trees. You're travelling. Um, again, you're travelling with this page of wands. There's messages coming in. You just want to go and do your next quest because it's like you you just want a, a break, like a, a stopgap before you go to to after you need to go to work. Do you know what I mean? It's like I'm gonna I've achieved all this. I need to have a break. I need to have a little bit of a dance here. New work, new love. With could be with a Taurus, but there's something of a uh, an institution like a. A diploma of some kind of commitment here that you're untrapping your mind from getting out of that that trap here like the trap door from keeping one person about finding out about another someone's coming out of some kind of commitment so that you can travel so someone's coming towards you very very fast but there's an ending here with the tower and the death card So that you could be a twin flame union that's, that can be like very fertile, it's very secretive, but there's something that this Gemini or Libra, this this air, this talking wants to happen. This seeks I want to tell you a secret. And it's reconciliation, they're saying you've already met this person. It's engagement in it and um this could be the one. 
oh my god <laughs> so, <laughs> let me ask the angels aries 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 for the week of the 14th of september please the week of the 14th look at that that's basically the moon you are confused yes i am and indecisive because you don't have enough information do research or seek expert advice before proceeding before making a decision that's that confusion with the moon what's happening angels spirit guides what would you like aries to know about this week of the 14th of september about this week of the 14th of september it could be like someone's untrapping themselves it could be travel there's some kind of an ending with the tower it's a shocking ending and uh but it brings about this eye to eye meeting with somebody where there's also some kind of secret around it wow what's going on when you take excellent care of yourself, everybody benefits. Give yourself a relaxing treat today, such as a massage, sea salt bath or pedicure. Do you get some news that's upsetting and you need to look after your health? Angels, spirit guides, you need to nurture. That moon is very motherly, it's very nurturing. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like those to know? Teaching and learning. Keep an open mind and learn new ideas and teach these to others. So you've mastered a craft here. You might be taking that craft and making it into something new and commit, committing to something that's brand new. But someone's offering you love. Someone you've got feeling for here. Someone's got a new beginning. They want to offer you a ring an engagement because there's some kind of trap they've been in um angel spirit guys one more please for aries 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 i am leading you to the answer to your prayers please listen to and follow i can't even see Please listen to and follow the steps I'm communicating through your intuition, thoughts and dreams. Go with your instincts with that moon and that you're being led somewhere. Sorry, Aries, this is a very strange read. I hope I've made some kind of sense. Um... Someone's caught in a trap. I can hear I'm caught in a trap. Can't walk out because I love you too much, baby. But something's ending here. There's a there's a shock ending. But it brings about this this soulmate union. Maybe it's an ending to this twin flame union or it's a because there's a secret about this person. I don't know, it could be, it's, it's saying there's a reconciliation, this is the soulmate and there's engagement. I would, I would just go with that. <laughs> oh God, sorry if I'm confused, I've been the gift to Susie and I will speak to you soon. Please like, share and subscribe. Bye bye.